I enjoyed the poetry of Gwendolyn Brooks. She was born in the year 1917 and died in the year 2000. She won the Pulitzer Prize in poetry. She was born in Topeka, Kansas and raised in Chicago. The poem, Sadie and Maud, is about two sisters. Sadie and Maud by Gwendolyn Brooks. Maud went to college. Sadie stayed at home. Sadie scraped life with a fine tooth comb. She didn't leave a tangle in. A comb found every strand. Sadie was one of the livingest chits in all the land. Sadie bore two babies under her maiden name. Maud and Ma and Papa nearly died of shame. Everyone but Sadie nearly died of shame. When Sadie said her last so long, her girl struck out from home. Sadie had left as heritage her fine tooth comb. Maud, who went to college, is a thin brown mouse. She is living all alone in this old House. To Be in Love by Gwendolyn Brooks. To be in love is to touch things with a lighter hand. In yourself, you stretch, you are well. You look at things through his eyes. A cardinal is red. A sky is blue. Suddenly you know he knows too. He is not there, but you know you are tasting together the winter or light spring weather. His hand to take your hand is over much, too much to bear. You cannot look in his eyes because your pulse must not say what must not be said. When he shuts a door is not there your arms are water and you are free with a ghastly freedom. You are the beautiful half of a golden hurt. You remember and covet his mouth to touch, to whisper on and Oh, when to declare a certain death. Oh, when to apprise is to mesmerize. To see fall down the column of gold into the commonest ash. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the poetry of African American women poets of the past. I end with Gwendolyn Brooks, We Real Cool. We Real Cool by Gwendolyn Brooks. The pool players, seven at the golden shovel. We real cool. 
We left school. We lurk late. We strike straight. We sing sin. We thin gin. We jazz June. We die soon.